is a place too that I can certainly, you know, uh, I can see the, that my kids would enjoy as well too. Not just. last night but today should be a good day it's nice and sunny out not a rain cloud in the sky we're gonna eat lunch today with uh, Lou Mangiello the host of Walt Disney World radio podcast and uh, just spend a nice day in the Magic Kingdom so last day of the trip though unfortunately Yeah. Are you talking about for the room safe? No. Like this. Oh yeah, it's in my pocket. Selling any tobacco today? What? Ask the Indian if he's selling any tobacco today. My favorite part of uh, Walt Disney World in uh, in the Magic Kingdom is Liberty Square, just because I don't know. For some reason, I just like the history, nostalgia part of Walt Disney World more than uh, kind of the new flashy stuff. And this area just exudes that, in my opinion. Especially because they have the Hall of Presidents here, and it's one of those attractions that you can never bulldoze because. Too many people would freak out. It's just too, it's too integral, it's too sovereign to the park. And I love that about an attraction. Plus the uh, Liberty Tree is just freaking cool. <laughs> I like the, that kind of an adjective for it, because it is. Visiting or is it, you know, that fallback restaurant? Um, I mean, I definitely did not eat anything that I dislike. I definitely would want to eat here again. Uh, we've been coming here for four years. And How many trips, though? Yeah. <laughs> four years, 23 trips. Yes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> 
uh, you know, I, I, eventually we, you know, I'm sure like a lot of people, eventually would like to try, you know, every restaurant on property. <laughs> but, you know, if we could find a, you know, get a reservation somewhere else, this would definitely be a good fallback. You know, some place that if we had tried yet wasn't available. So. Yeah, and this is a place too that I can certainly, you know, I can see that my kids would enjoy as well too, not just for the theming and the decor, but again, there's food here that is beyond hamburgers and chicken nuggets that I know my kids would really enjoy as well too. Because a lot of the, the food is not spicy, it's not scary, they would be able to eat anything. So Rach and I are on the TTA and I'm all sweaty, as you can see. Uh, yeah, we're at the Christmas party here, and uh, it's raining just slightly. It's a, it's just a, a drizzle. It's kind of a, an annoying drizzle. Uh, but the humidity spikes. It's really high. Keep your eyes peeled. I am. I can't handle it. I'm sweating like crazy. But uh, anyway, we did that dinner we just had, or that lunch slash dinner, I guess, with uh, Lou. It went just, long enough. It went from lunch to coming out the station's greatest hit, where you can report yeah. for duty. As that went amazing. I mean, Mangello is just like the ultimate Disney geek, like us, and you know, he we got to just talk to him about our aspirations, and he told us about his. And, you know, he really talked a lot about little details in the parks that we like to talk about, and it's just a very, very vivid highlight of our uh, of our trip this 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 year, uh, 2012. And uh, today is December 11th. And uh, we are on the TTA, just waiting for the Christmas party to start. We'll probably do the Hall of Presidents here pretty soon. And uh, other than that, you know, I don't know. I, mean, I think we'll just enjoy the Christmas party. It's dark. Hey, look at that. Epcot. So, anyway, I'll shut you off here because it's getting a little bit dark. busy tonight. We're hoping the rain quits. Yawning, Rachie. The thing is, is that people are here for the party. Thank you for joining Even though it's raining, tomorrow. they're not going to leave because they paid a lot of money to I come know. to the party. The so. That's kind of sucks. If it was just a regular park night, then yeah, people would probably leave. Maybe go someplace else. People cared. Please keep your arms away from the doors, and then you will see it until they slide open automatically. Step onto the moving platform with caution, and exit by stepping away from the car.
Richie. Pretty cool. You guys haven't done the uh, Mickey's Very Merry Christmas party? It's worth it. Let's do it once. This is our third time, I think. But uh, it's a tradition for us. Mickey's Very Merry Christmas party. Yes. Is it worth it? Yes. What else can you do here? There's a special parade, special fireworks, you can get hot chocolate. Cookies. Cookies. See characters that are sometimes aren't usually out during the day. True.
near or far. Look high or low, and you'll always find there's no place like home for the holidays. Because after all, home is where.
Christmas. Good night. For you guys. Hey, speaking of which, what's the name of the red nosed reindeer? Rudolph.